Thank you, Brianna, for that report. Well, today the 1st Armored Division hosted a change of command ceremony. This comes as Major General Eisenhower is set to leave Fort Bliss to go to his next assignment. ABC 7's Gabby Hernandez is live with the details. Gabby. Hey, Paul, I'm right here in front of Fort Bliss where the ceremony took place this morning. Here's video of how they welcome the new leader. The symbolic ceremony included the performance of the military band. After serving for two years, General Major Eisenhower officially passed the authority of the 1st Armored Division in Fort Bliss. They welcomed the new leader, General Major Curtis Taylor. Eisenhower's next assignment is to serve as the Assistant Deputy Chief of Staff for the U.S. Army in Washington, D.C. Here's what Taylor had to say. The Team Bliss and all our partners on this post, this great installation is our home and the only place in the world where the Army can train at the scale and scope that we do here. To our new El Paso family, Jennifer and I look forward to getting to know each of you better. And coming up on ABC 7 at 6, what Taylor hopes to accomplish on his new role. For now, reporting live from Fort Bliss, I'm Gabby Hernandez, ABC 7.